exposed forest habitat of the interesting mushroom known as Cordyceps gunny, found mainly in Victoria and also New South Wales and Tasmania. This mushroom also grows in the soil of the open woodland. Watch this life cycle closely and try to work out what is happening. Three stars The alien thing that took its form Then to Lebanon Oh God The flashing at night The sirens grow and grow Here you can see the mushroom beginning to grow up through the soil. The white matter in the dirt was actually once a caterpillar, but it has been covered by the mycelium or roots of the fungus. The infected caterpillar is actually 5 to 8 millimetres long. The head of the mushroom is dark olive green and usually 50 to 60 millimetres long. Once fully grown, the fungus releases spores from its velvety surface, which spread along the soil beneath it. These spores allow the fungus to reproduce. After the mushroom has released its spores, it dies and falls to the forest floor, where it rapidly decomposes due to its high water content. Along comes a colourful caterpillar. I'm so hungry. He is hungry and looking for food. Although the fungus is gone, it is left behind the reproducing spores and the caterpillar unknowingly ingests one whilst breathing. I don't feel so good. Gradually, the caterpillar is mummified as a fungus grows inside him. Like the sprout emerging from a seed, the spore grows white thread-like mycelium. Similar to the roots of a plant, the mycelium gets food for the fungus from the surrounding soil or decaying wood. When the conditions are right, the mycelium forms a bud-like structure and gradually the mushroom emerges, grows, releases spores, dies and then decomposes. The life cycle continues. Music